There's a family on the far north side of Indianapolis picking through their belongings tonight after losing nearly everything when their house caught fire. It happened last weekend on 101st Street, just north of 465. Our Emily Longnecker tells us the warning they now have for others. Last weekend seemed like the perfect chance for Richard Hawkins to try out the wood burning stove in his garage. First time, you know, starting to get chilly going from the nice weather. Hawkins, his wife, four kids, and two dogs had just moved into the home a few months earlier. Just started kind of getting everything settled in. That all changed early Sunday morning when the family woke up to smoke everywhere. I heard the alarm going off and I just kind of knew instantly. So I just jumped out of bed and ran and got the kids and the dogs. And I ran to the back and seen it was a fire and tried to put like some water on it from the hose, but it was, she's yelling at me, it's too bad, get out. Thankfully, the entire family got out safely, but not before most of their belongings were lost to the fire or damaged by smoke and water from the fire crews trying to put out the flames. I'm just overwhelmed. I'm shocked. I'm upset and angry. I'm a little bit of everything, really. Adding to the family's stress, they didn't have renter's insurance, so everything they've lost, they have to replace on their own. Their first priority, though, is finding a place to live. With no insurance, you feel like a fool. You know, everybody tells you to have insurance, and you never think it's going to happen. I got to save up, and I got to find a place to live. Right now, the Hawkins family is just trying to focus on the fact that everyone is okay. Everything else you can replace. It's not your family. Emily Longnecker, Channel 13 Eyewitness News. The family says fire officials have told them the fire was likely caused by a clogged flue in the wood burning stove.